the extension of time allows um, the builder to be able to generate extra time on the contract based on the fact that um, there are circumstances that, that occur during the build. He doesn't have to pay any liquidated damages and that's a major uh, benefit of, of using the RBN contract. Where it uh, specifies materials to be used by the uh, owner, the owner then indemnifies the builder on the contract. So all those materials then become the responsibility of the owner and not the builder. In a normal circumstance of contract, it is the builder's responsibility, uh, whereas under the RBN contract, it is the owner's responsibility. In the standard uh, contracts, there is no allowance for demolition of works, but in the RBN contract, the benefit to the builder, there is a section there that mentions demolition of works, and it's the owner's responsibility to make sure that all debris are cleared off-site and a clearance certificate provided to the builder. This ensures that most of the um, rubble has been removed off-site. In the standard contracts, there is no allowance for um, electronic communication. In the RBN contract, it is, um, it is actually encouraged that um, builders have communication with the owners through electronic communication, that being emails, texts, um, facts or any of uh, that rather than putting it into a, um, to a, a letter and sending that out. It just saves you time and effort as a builder to speed up the job. In the RBN contract, there is a section for um, the contract documentations that are supplied by the owner. This section allows the builder to make sure that all the documents are correct and if they're not, they need to go back to the owner for the owner to go back to the um, architect and engineers to make sure that those documents are correct. So it alleviates the responsibility to the builder um, in regards to those documents. In the RBN contract, there is a section that talks about construction period. So basically your starting time in your contract is 21 days from the issuing of the building permit if no date it is included in that, um, in that section. So it's a benefit to builders to make sure uh, they've got more than enough time to be able to construct the uh, development in that uh, construction period. So there's quite a few benefits to builders and I would highly recommend that all builders use this contract just for the fact of the protection that you are getting.